Get me out of here. There is no need for that. This one knows who you are, Lilith. The papers. Here. Interesting activity. Thanks. This. This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. Think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. I don't deal with any applicants these days, so don't bother asking. Turns out who runs Venterhold doesn't change much. Can't say I'm surprised. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. We got the papers. Just a quick look through them, and it gives us a better idea on what's going on over at Pazarath. Not yet. There's something I want to show you. Come. It isn't too far. I see. Well, let me know if things get out of hand. Open the safe, and take out the bottle. There it is. The thing that started this war. Project Purity called it Aerosap. One drop is all it takes to increase the sex drive of female victim to extreme levels. It has no effect on males, just as purity intended. Once the victim is under the influence, the effects are permanent, until they are past the age of childbearing. The psychological effects stay for a lifetime. All the sirens know the story of the Pinder twins that were poisoned by this. Two hundred years ago, the world was so close to destruction and they didn't even know it. Not because of the Oblivion Crisis, but because of this. 
If Purity's plans hadn't been foiled, we'd all be under their reign. They would have distributed it to the wealthiest clients first. They would have controlled our populations. All it took was one person to stop that from happening. Serenity, the being that our Order is named after. Her sacrifice to destroy the source of Arasap set Purity back years. Enough time for the Pinder family to grow and expand, to fight, and to die. Each generation has sacrificed everything to stop Purity. God's willing. Kasha will not be among them. That's the last bottle of Arosap. It's not mine. It's Freya's. There. Hm. <laughs> no. Freya doesn't need it. You've seen her. Probably talked to her. She kept it as a trophy. I don't know how she got her hands on it in the first place. But it's definitely the last. There were 23 bottles accounted for and recovered purity manifests. All but one was destroyed. She showed it off whenever we came up here for training. It gave us a motivation to persevere. There's no need for that now. We have all the motivation we need after everything that's happened. I wanted to ask you something, but it should wait. Talia must be getting worried sick. Return to the carriage when you're ready to leave for Dawnstar. We're ready to leave.
One city down, one more to go. Ready? You don't need to tell me twice. Got the reports, but we might have trouble. There was an odd man in leather armor at the inn. He was obviously interested in me and the agent. Go ahead. Best if I stay here since he already saw me. Be careful. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. It's a curse. It has to be. I I've got to get out of this town. Irgner, get a hold of yourself. They're just dreams. Please tell her, Erander. Listen to your friend, Fruki. They are just dreams, my dear. I assure you that it is quite normal. It's the same dream. For crying out loud, what is it now? That's normal. It's ah, normal, I tell you. damn. You're not my drinking, buddy. Drinking away my troubles, friend. You? Who are you? Her wife? Can a man scope out the goods without having somebody jump down his throat? I will. Thank you. You know what? There is. But I ain't talking. Unless you buy me some black by a mead. Yeah, yeah. I can watch the end while you're away. Why would I do that? There's work to be done here. It'll do you good. Maybe you could visit Ergnir or Fruki on your way out. I've seen them looking at you when they come in for drinks. Why would they be looking at me? Are they upset about the service? Oh, never mind. Need a room? Don't worry. Nightmares don't seem to happen for travelers. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. All right then. So, you bought me some meat or what? Haha! <laughs> That's the good stuff! Yeah, yeah. So, here's the thing. I was so interested in the blue-haired freak because her kind had crossed paths with my old family. Ever heard of the Dark Brotherhood? I used to be with them before they kicked me out. Me and my buddies were all blamed for botching those strings of missions a while back. 
Don't know if you've ever heard of them ashen women with a tendency to stick their fingers into our business. Every single damn mission. They showed up. Stole our kill. Gold. Whatever. And we were all freshly inducted into the Brotherhood. Poor sobs who barely killed a couple of mercs before we started going after the big contracts. All of us were kicked out for such pathetic attempts at fulfilling our duties. They didn't believe a word we said. <laughs> Can you believe it? The hottest women this side of Tamriel beat us to the punch. Oh, don't go telling that story around the taverns. Yep. But, I don't have to tell you that. You know her. So you two an item or what? Well, don't say I didn't warn you. Listen here. I want some serious payback against those bitches. Just say the word and me and my buddies will follow you to the ends of the world to take them out. Mother always said to go out with a bang. I'd die happy. I got to sink my sword into at least one of them for getting me kicked out of the family. Whatever you say, but if you change your mind, you know where to find me. Just ask for Dimitri. I can get my entire crew ready within days. Remember, friend, when the entire world seems to have turned against you, you are not alone. Hey, barkeeper! Another drink! I'm dying of thirst over here. Did you figure out why he was so curious? Okay, that's what I thought. Assuming he's not lying, I doubt he has any affiliations with the heroes or purity. We should get going. The way back will be a lot more eventful, with a possible ambush. Remember to stay alert. Hey, I got this guy under control. Don't worry about me. Let's hit the road. Keep your eyes peeled for shady characters. That's a long drop. This sure is dangerous. <laughs> what am I thinking? No. Really? <laughs> that reminds me.
Poor Lilith. I hate seeing her like this. Maybe you should go cheer her up or something. Oh, I guess Lilith told you, huh? As far as Marcus knew, Freya was just another instructor. The two never conversed. Matari knows Freya. I don't think she really disapproves. She might even be encouraging it. But that's our mistress. She knows best. I've studied everything there is about purity. What do you want to know? Gotcha. Commander? Yes. I take it you're going to ask about Misha? They must. The consequences would be enormous if they found out you were her killer, and I obliged. Thank you. I appreciate it. I could have left Serenity's silence after the incident, but I didn't. Even though I disagreed with everything Freya put me through, I chose to stay. It would have been selfish of me otherwise. Our order was born out of man's hope to save his family, and to destroy the evil that was infecting the world. How could I abandon a cause like that? I showed you at Winter Hold. Why we choose to fight. Our methods might not be the same, but we are all sisters, fighting for something we can believe in. But you, what are you fighting for? Are you doing this by your own will? What do you have to gain if we win? Aren't we all in this world? More so for the Ashen. We have nowhere else to go, except the battlefield. And when there is nothing left to fight, what do you plan on doing with the rest of your life? Neither am I, but it's interesting to think about, nonetheless. I don't know. Marcus promised us that we would all be free when purity was removed from the world. That all sirens would be welcome to live in Jonestead, where we could live out the rest of our lives in peace. But he's dead. Matari has never spoken to us of the future, and none of us have really cared. She's like a mother to some of us. Her presence gives some of us hope that everything will be all right, no matter the outcome. Disbanding Serenity Sirens after the war was Marcus's plan, with Matari. I think she wants to keep the Order intact, so we can all be together. Did I? Sorry, I misspoke. The truth is, I'm just as curious about our fate as you are. Understood. You should get some rest before we make our way to checkpoint four. Pasosilumara. Peace be with you, sister.
Yes. Mm-hmm. The carriage is prepped and ready to go. Oh, my head. What happened? The ride back is going to be terrible for me. <sighs> Let's go. All right. A trap. Come, but keep your weapon drawn. Let him make no sudden movements. Oh, okay, you young ass. Have mercy on the pitiful man. Keep your hands where we can see them. But what reason would I have to harm? How are you really expecting us to fall for your charade, Purity? No. I expect you to fall for this.
report. I killed this guy right when he was about to stab Talia. This invisibility spell. Too bad his robes gave off a glint. You just have to know what to look for. Aren't you glad you brought me along? Thanks, Sammy. I owe you one. Don't mention it. Good work, all of you. <sighs> Looks like the hero is safe, too. We're lucky his comrades didn't release him in the midst of the battle. Lilith, I've got bad news. I found this note on his body. They've been taking out the checkpoints. They knew our route. There's only one way to find out if they've succeeded. We'll be passing by checkpoint 4 on the way back to the palace. We can confirm whether this man's reports are true, judging by what we find. Either way, we need to leave immediately and alert Trisha. Mount up, everyone. Why do you bother bringing me? I'll die before I talk. We won't allow that to happen. I know your methods, Siren. The lunatic back at your camp wasn't shy about torture. A splinter group of the Order. You won't have to worry about them, as long as I'm by your side. It won't take long before you lose control. know what we are fighting for. We're not fighting for purity or their cause. We fight because we know our enemies, unlike you. Is this a joke? Let him speak. All of you are slaves. Can't you see where your superiors are taking you? They promise you freedom, but they will keep you tied down to their cause. You're better than that. Rise above them. Fight for your freedom to be outside of this prison you call your home. We are not a means to an end for any ideal. Join the heroes and your lives will be spared. Together, we can all defeat the evil that's spreading across the land and bring justice to our world. So says the mercenary man. The only way to survive in this world is to fight for the cause that will let you live long enough to fight for your own. This is my end, and I owe it all to you. Your name would have lived on for eternity. The heroes turn away no man or woman willing to have their legacy imprinted on history. Convince Bosca if you can. My job of spreading the message is over. It's time for me to face my fate. It's him. I can't believe it. One of the most detested names in the Heroes, 
and the sole reason why we exist. How appropriate that I die here. Here, take that, you fiend. <laughs> Freya! Easy there, Saber Kitten. Haven't you heard? We don't take prisoners. We needed him alive! Oh no. What are you going to do? Forget it. We need to speak with Trisha immediately. Oh, about the attacks. Go on ahead. I need to clean up the mess this guy made. How typical. Come to give me a scalding? Um, was he any good to us alive? Besides, I'm not in the mood for interrogations right now. Maybe next mission. Speaking of missions, how was yours? Did you get to meet my friend? Come on now, I know you did. Long green hair, smells like a spriggan. Misha. They're not telling me anything. I hope she wasn't killed. It would be such a shame after everything she's gone through. A drink. Want to join me at the Sahel bar later? By tallest to you deserve some relaxation. It's bad. So please tell me you have some good news. The reports. They're regrouping to defend Pazarath. They never planned to continue roadside attacks, with or without the commander in our ranks. They're taunting us. How are the other teams doing? The ones dispatched right after us? Fine, as far as we know. Nothing as bad as what I heard your team faced. Any news on Checkpoint 4? Completely demolished. Their bodies were already ash when we passed by. So that's it then. All we have left in the east is checkpoint two. The ambush. Can you describe their armament? Twelve standard heroes of Nern. One purity assassin. He used shock explosives. The shock explosives are classic purity. Too classic. They're keeping their latest advancements a secret until they need them the most. Yeah, yeah, let's cast the chase. Is Misha alive? 
I'm sorry. She didn't make it. The scouts reported that a purity assassin killed her before the attack. The commander subdued him. She's dead? Is this true, commander? A purity assassin? Or did a certain skiver get her grubby little hands on poor Misha? It's the truth. I wasn't talking to you, failure. Anyway, I heard you brought a prisoner. Um, about that. Oh, forgive me, ma'am. I didn't mean to intrude. Everyone, thank you for your service. We lost many women today, but do not lose hope. Every step we take, every piece of knowledge we gain, brings us closer to launching our operation to retake Pazarath. Commander, as ordered by Mistress Matari, here is your payment. 10,000 for completing the mission. 5,000 for the hero of Nurn prisoner, despite his demise. 3,500 for leaving a teammate behind to defend Checkpoint 2. Pfft, that 3,500 is practically for Misha's death. And, as promised, your katana can be picked up from our weaponsmith. All of you dismissed. I'll have your next assignments available very soon. Commander, may I speak to you when you have the chance? Well, all in all, you did good. Now that we know what they're doing, we can see about intercepting them as they make their way to Pazarath. If we take out one group at a time, it should even the odds for the final attack. I want you to do that. Yes. Based on your performance, you're more than capable of handling this mission. I need to send Lilith's team out to recover what's left of the checkpoints you visited in the meantime. Wait, wait. The Commander isn't doing this alone. The Dark Elf is going with her. Alaray? She barely managed to survive the attack. She can't... Just do it, Lord. Yes, Freya. As you wish. Never mind, then. Alaray will be joining you. She hasn't told us. One of our scouts found her as she was walking back to the palace after the attack. She is severely traumatized, which is why I wasn't planning on sending her out into the field. I'm sorry that you have to take her with you. You'll find her outside in the grotto. Allow me to explain your mission, then I'll let you go. You're going to Nightgate Inn, small place, not too far west from Checkpoint 2 and Fort Castoff. If these reports are correct, you should be able to drop in right when a convoy of heroes will be passing through the area. Whatever you have to do, take those heroes out silently, dress up in their gear, and merge with the next group that comes by. Come up with a believable story about what happened to the rest of your team, and they should let you in their ranks. Eventually, you'll come to a chasm northwest of Snowvale Sanctum, where the heroes must pass through to board their boats destined for Pazarath. I want you and Alaray to wipe out the heroes there, hide their bodies, and do the same to the next few groups. Once you've done enough damage, or can't handle anymore, return to the palace. Understood? Understood. Oh, and since you're going to the grotto, you may want to check on Ms. Pinder. She should be out there, training with Kalisa right about now. That should be all. Good luck! Poor Alarai. Will she ever learn to brush herself up? <laughs> Guess you'll be the first to find out. For once, nothing. Nothing at all. Look at it this way. She has to learn to be brave to live in this world. The best way to do that is to send her out on a simple mission. You might be doing all the work, but hey, that will make her feel guilty, and then she'll have to fight. Why? She 
she told you? Great to see you back in one piece. Purity loves katanas and so do we. That's why I have the finest in all of Tamriel. Right here, right now. It's all up to you. Just go with the one that looks the most stylish or go with the standard siren issue if you don't want to be a show-off. Everywhere. I tell Tarius what we need, and he gets it for us through the proper channels. Some of these katanas are imported from Akavir, and others are custom-made by the finest weaponsmiths we know. Those that we don't buy, I make myself. It's a delicate craft, but entertaining. You learn a lot by studying the work of others. Marcus was a strong warrior. All the training he went through in anticipation of fighting purity proved he was ready for just about anything. He died without ever seeing combat, and that's a shame that no warrior should suffer. He deserved more. Katanas, katanas, and more katanas. Have a look. Certainly. Now, would you prefer a one-handed blade or two-handed? Okay, here you go. No problem. Now, go enjoy yourself and enchant it if you'd like. No for our enemies.
my movements. That is where my katana will strike. But how? You're moving too fast. Concentrate on our duel and not on the commander. Then you will know. Don't mind us. Focus on your mission. I will train Kaja to be an outstanding warrior. Hey! I was really worried about you after we got news of the attacks on the checkpoints. I guess that means they're going to send you out to do more work, huh? I'm trying to strengthen my swing, but then I start failing to block in time. Could you? That might help. If Kalisa is fine with that. Of course. As long as it doesn't interfere with the commander's current mission, then I don't see any harm. It may be what you need, Miss Pindle. You know the commander better than you know me. It may ease your tension. I'll be by the stairs if you need me. Okay. So what combat form should I practice? Maybe I should switch weapons and try something lighter? I'm only giving you some suggestions. Blocking? Sure, but you do have a shield or sword, right? I don't want to hurt you or anything. Fine, fine. Just let me know when you're ready to begin. Are you ready? Defend yourself! Hope you were impressed. I get the idea. Dodge, dodge, block, strike. Aw, that's what I've been doing. Thanks for the help anyway. At least I got some experience. You should get back to your mission. Training with me would get really boring. Really fast. Good luck. Oh, by the way, I asked them to give me some time off so I can get back to cleaning your houses. I'll let you know what they say. Commander, you, you stopped by our camp before it was attacked. It was horrible. I ran. I ran and hid as heroes descended upon our camp. They killed Emmy from behind. Aradurumi was overpowered. Aradurumi led them away from my hiding spot. She saved me, even though she hated me. One more final sorry, Aradurumi. For you, this scroll. I can make all the pain go away. Vanishes all heroes. No more running away. For Pazareth, for Aradurumi, I'm done being afraid. I hope Oblivion, or somewhere is equally hot. I want them to burn for their sins. I want them to die. Yes, yes! Night Gate Inn. The heroes stand at the gates of darkness. A fitting name for their graves. Let us go. Hurry, hurry! I'm eager for vengeance! No, no! We should hurry, no time to talk. <laughs> 